What are those physical limitations? that we have a limited amount of space for gas pressure to fill. So there must also be a limited amount of ground underneath that volume. No, that's incorrect. Oh, really? Yeah. How so? Uh, well, because that's you can have dynamic spread, systems that could expand vastly beyond the current area that we're in. Now, does that mean that we don't need containment? No, no, that still applies. But that doesn't mean that the containment is relatively local. It could be in, I don't know, a million miles out towards that south. It's south, a million miles, Arwen, potentially. But let's just say yeah, that so. not, notwithstanding that we don't know anything about the containment, right? Therefore, we can't infer a limitation to the land. And I'm saying, do you know of a physical limitation to the land? I just know there is an antecedent and physical in and infinity doesn't coincide. No, I'm not I saying don't know it's infinite. How much, though. No, no, I, I've just said, I'll try and rephrase it. Right, Regardless of the requirement for containment, that containment could be vast. So if we just take away the uh, requirement for containment, it's a given. We must be contained. It goes without saying. But that containment doesn't have to lie on the edge of an ice wall there's not suddenly well the limitation to the land is the limitation to the gas pressure well okay if you want me to rephrase it that way what what's the limitation to the gas pressure then arwin i don't know but, right but so if you don't know yeah, the limitation to the gas pressure you can't use that in your argument say that there's a simultaneous coinciding limitation to the land also yeah. Is vast the same thing as infinite? Uh, yeah, vast would be more than what we've got. And I'm saying, do you know of any limitation? Because currently we've got a, a finite amount of land that's portrayed to us. Well, do you know of a limitation to that finite amount of land that we're shown currently or not? To the presupposed no. available things, no. There, there should be a limit according to that but no, I don't know exactly what the volumetrics are of the realm. I do know it cannot be infinite space. Finally, Sasha. In uh, so when Sasha asked earlier about getting a radius to Earth itself, we don't know the boundaries. We don't know the limitations. We don't know its vastness. So how are we supposed to, uh, first of all, uh, <laughs> ascribe a shape to it that's going to have a, a radius it could, to it? It could, it could be cube, you know, container. And then is no radius. It's square.